What's up guys? We are in beautiful Laguna Beach today. My little sister wanted to hit up the beach, so we're walking down to the water right this second. I just had to parallel park the car. I did an awesome job, considering I don't know how to parallel park. Well, I, I parallel parked the car without another car in front of me. So I kind of, I kind of parallel parked. But there was no car in front, only a car in back. Laguna Beach is such a pretty town, seriously. Well, we're right next to the highway, so the cars are really, oh, and I just almost walked into that meter. I wasn't looking where I was walking because I was vlogging. Whoopsies. I guess I still think of my little sister as a little kid. She keeps going like, Nikki, I'm 17, because I keep trying to hold her hand while we cross the street. <laughs> I'm like, you need to hold my hand, Danica. All right, we are down at the beach. I really do like the beaches in Laguna Beach. I love the rock formations Isn't that they have everywhere. Huh? Isn't there only one beach? What do you mean? Oh, yeah, like the in all beaches. of California? No. In, <laughs> <laughs> they're like, I like the beaches at Laguna Beach. There's yeah. only one. Well, there's more than one. They're really? called different, yeah. Huh. Like different areas. Okay, I'm a Minnesotan. It would be really cool to have a house right on the beach like this. But it's probably a couple million dollars to live there. <laughs> Yay, ocean! Cute guys, please. What? Can we choose a spot by some cute guys? Uh, that's your department. Fine, dude. I don't care. <laughs> I already have a cute guy at home. I want to go in the ocean. No, it's a fake ocean. <laughs> really? You just asked if that's a real ocean? Oh, it might be a lake. <laughs> it's all fake. Hollywood movie magic. <laughs> That ocean is fake and gay. What is that, a jellyfish? Or like a piece of a jellyfish? I don't know, but it looks gross. Isn't that a cool little cove over there? I think that's really, really pretty. Don't you? you gorgeous. <laughs> Let's lay down over here. This place is pretty secluded. We go over there. We can go play in there. Okay. Let's go play. It's a nice warm day out. I don't know how tan we're gonna get. There's a bit of overcast, but at least it's warm. Sometimes you get down to the beach and it's just freezing. I want to get tan. Yeah, you still might get a little tan. Hopefully, yeah. Rays come through the clouds. It just doesn't feel as warm. Yeah. <laughs> But I looked on the weather and I looked at all the beaches around here and it said Laguna Beach was the warmest and today was the best day to go. Really? It's the yeah. warmest? All the other beaches were like 70 degrees mm. and it's 80, 80 something out in Laguna Beach. So that's why we're here and we didn't go to Huntington or something. Well, I but just I like, like it. it. The beach is really pretty though, isn't it? Yeah. And I wanted to go because of the show, Laguna Beach. <laughs> Because of the show. Now the sun decided to poke out a little bit. Feels really nice. It decided to, to come out from behind the clouds. <laughs> I hope I get a tan. I need a tan really, really badly. I have all these awkward tan lines from going running every day. Like I have short tan lines and tan lines for my tank top. It's kind of weird. <laughs> so we need to get my whole body nice and golden brown. And now the sun is gone again. <laughs> it keeps tricking me. It like comes out of the clouds and then goes back in. You need to just stay out of the clouds, son. Come on now. Give us a nice day at the beach. I'm gonna take a dip in the ocean. I put my toes in there and it was really cold, so I just gotta man up and run in there and get it over quickly. But I want to take a dip in the ocean today. I went running in there and I thought it would be all sand at the bottom and there's a ton of rocks on the ground so I bolted in and just tripped and I scraped up my legs a little bit. Owie. I'm gonna explore this cool cove over here. I think this is the same place I went to with John a couple years ago because I feel like I remember this cove. But let's go check it out. Hopefully I don't drop my camera in the ocean. Oh, isn't this neat? Yeah, I do think I've been here before. Oh, I almost fell. Cool tide pool. 
I want to climb up there like those people, but I totally think I'd fall. <laughs> Knowing me. This beach is really cool to look at, but they have all these rocks everywhere. It hurts your feet. It's hard to walk around here. Cool, there's all these little fish in here. Ah. I'm so scared these rocks are gonna make me fall. How are we gonna get over there? Yeah, and they hurt your feet. Look, here's a couple crabs, a hermit crab there, and then a regular crab, I guess, on top. They're eating a dead clam or something. Oh my god, it's floating away! No, 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 no! I see a crab! Hi, crab! Hi! Oh, he's looking at me! Huh, come here! It's okay, little crab. Don't go in your hole. Come say hi. I like your claws. What you eating? I wonder if anyone hears me talking to crabs and are like, what is that girl's damage? Oh, there's people snorkeling out there. Lucky? I wish I had a snorkel. That looks fun. Cute, I caught a little hermit crab. I'm gonna go show this to my sister. Danica! Ah! <laughs> <laughs> Were you asleep? <laughs> I caught a hermit crab. Look at it. There's a hermit crab in my hand. I can't see it. Get up! I'm no makeup on. Oh no. Oh. <laughs> You're so naked. Are we gonna keep them? No, I'll let them go. Aww. I'll put them back in the tide pool. They have hermit crabs, regular crabs, sea anemones. Let's check it out. But it, I want, is there a real crab? Is this a real crab? Is that a real ocean? Is that a real Shut crab? Up. What are we doing? That is not today? what I asked, actually. You just said, is that a real crab? No, I said, are there like real crabs, like big crabs? Like, the, I didn't crabs? see any like that big, but yeah, they, they have crabs and they're bigger than this one. Okay, that's what I want. Okay, I'm gonna put this little guy back where I found him. Uh, I'm not gonna take the camera this time. The tide is starting to come in a little more, and when I was walking over here, the camera got splashed. So I'm like, crap, I don't wanna break the camera. The sound of the ocean is really relaxing. I'm gonna try and take a nap. Ooh, now the water's getting close. We're gonna fall asleep and the tide's gonna come all the way in, and we're gonna get wet. And the waves got us. <laughs> we were like chilling out, laying down, and all of a sudden our feet were soaked, and the bottom of our towels was soaked. So we had to move up a bit. I just grabbed a handful of wet sand and out popped this thing and it started running around. I have no idea what this is. Does anyone know what kind of creature this is? It's like, it looks like a trilobite or something, <laughs> but I don't know if those still exist. What is this thing? It's like, it's hard like a crab, but he looks like a bug. Oh, it flipped on its back. Anybody know what that is? And that's how he walks. We're taking a little walk right now, partly because I don't remember where we parked, both of us don't remember, and partly because we want to explore Laguna Beach a little bit. We want to see the town. We're hoping we might see like a restaurant or an ice cream shop walking around. Conrad. Donica's hoping we'll see Lauren Conrad walking around. I think she lives in LA, but Never Maybe know. she's visiting her parents. <laughs> we saw the car, everything will be all right. <laughs> that didn't take long to find the car. We were just like walking like, oh, there it is right there. Walked for about two minutes and saw it. So we're gonna keep walking around and now our main reason is to explore Laguna Beach. We're like on this wild goose chase to find gelato right now. Every place we go, they're like, oh, you're really close. It's like a block away. It's a block here, it's a block there, it's a block here, it's a block there. And it's taking us forever to find this ice cream. People always say we're really, really close, and then we walk for a really long time. Like the wrong way. <laughs> yeah, and then this way was the wrong way. So this better be the best gelato I've ever had in my life. I'm getting really scared that our meter's gonna run out. So I'm trying to get it real quick, and then we're gonna have to power walk back and eat on the eat on the run. Finally, this is gigantic. I ordered a medium, and it's huge. Okay. So it is really good gelato. I got half caramel and half mango. Mm. It's delicious. I just hope I don't get a ticket because I don't know if it's worth like a $60 parking ticket. Woo! 
we ran all the way back to the car. We were like, crap, the meter's gonna be expired. And the meter was expired, but we beat the traffic cop or whatever they're called. What are they called? The meter maid. We beat the meter maid okay. and we didn't get a ticket. And now I put a quarter in the meter so that I can enjoy my ice cream in my car because I can't drive and eat this thing at the same time. It's pretty big. But Donica finished her gelato. How was it? So good. Could you even enjoy it since you were running the whole time? <laughs> no, at all. Pretty good multitasker. Home again, home again. Well, that was a lovely trip to the beach in my opinion. Donica, did you like Laguna Beach? Yeah, it was awesome. Yeah? Mm -hmm. What did you like the most about our day? Hmm, probably the running. <laughs> Just watching <laughs> Nikki run with her ice cream, she looked like such a freak. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> and her scream in the car. <laughs> yeah, I, okay, well you've seen me in prank videos. I am a huge spaz in everyday <laughs> situations too. Like, I'm a yeller. I yell really loud. <laughs> and I thought we took the toll roads back and I thought I missed one of the toll plazas. And I was just like, ah, no! There's gonna be like a hundred dollars! <laughs> And then all of a sudden, <laughs> I jumped on my seat. Yeah, I got a ticket for missing a toll not too long ago, and they're pretty expensive. But the GPS kept telling me to stay left, and the toll plaza was on the right, and so I missed the toll plaza uh, like a couple months ago, and then I had to pay, then I got that big ticket in the mail. And this time I was all scared that I spaced out and missed the toll plaza on accident, but, but I didn't, so it was all good. You're not going to believe this. But I made this. John made some shelves for the garage today. There was crap everywhere in this garage. Now it's half clean. Now I'm gonna put shelves over there. I think someone commented on one of our videos that our garage looked like a meth lab. Yeah, well, we did. <laughs> finally sold a few batches. We got done with the fifth season of Breaking Bad, so we were able to, you know, get rid of all the meth and build some shelves. <laughs> but I'm really excited because it's like completely organized now. It's amazing how much stuff we have and accumulate from pranks. Because like half this crap is just prank stuff. So that was our exciting beach day. Always remember, guys, that I love you and stay tuned for more vlogs. P.S. Me and Donica both just smelled our armpits and we smell really bad.